Hey guys, your boy one eight here. I'm gonna be um, playing Moto GP13. Now I'm really, really sorry I didn't post um, a Moto GP13 um, video close to its release. Um, it's just because of Le Mans, the British Grand Prix, and German Grand Prix. You know that's been really affecting the you know Moto GP videos and all that. But um, but because you know um, the Formula One boys are going to be taking um, I think a three weeks a three week break um, from the German Grand Prix weekend, that means that I get to um, do some MotoGP and next week I'm going to have some Grid Two. So yeah, folks, a lot of new things coming up um, through the next two weeks, folks. So yeah, really something to be looking forward to. So yeah. So here we go folks, we're going to be riding as Bradley Smith in the Monster Yamaha Tech 3 machine um, at the Saxon Marine because um, obviously um, this week it is the German Grand Prix um, for the MotoGP boys so um, what better time um, to do it um, and yeah and um, what better you know place to do it than that so yeah. And welcome to the Saxon Ring. The waiting is finally over, and the MotoGP Grand Prix of Germany will get underway in just a few minutes. As you can see, the skies are clear at the moment, but there's still a layer of water on the track's surface, and that will give the riders a very hard time. So here we go, folks. So yeah, I'm going to be starting at the back of the grid, um, reason being um, is that, um, you know, in this game, it, um, for any rider, you are put to the back of the grid, I don't know the reason why for that, um, but yeah, it's not just, you know, one or two, it's just all, so yeah, so yeah, that sucks. So here we go guys, revs are up, we're ready for a start. Coming into the first corner, breaking really early because these guys like to go really late into, on the breaks. As we are now heading into this next corner, I'm right down the back of the grid. I'm just taking it really nice and clean. I don't want to go um, really light into the into the pack. I'm just going to wait. I'm going to let everyone spread out and then do my uh, moves. So really not being very, not going for, not being, you know, punchy um, through the pack. Just take it one at a time. So coming into this next corner, I'm passing Hernandez. I'm right on the back of Abraham. I'm now past Abraham. Getting past a couple of riders. I'm right on the back of Ileone now. I've got Corti ahead of me as we are now heading onto this um, fast sweeper here. Going on to the Astro here, and, oh, almost running, um, almost um, falling off my bike there, so I'm going to use my flashback to do that again. So yeah, I'm going down the inside there of Ileone now, I'm coming right on the back of the Punier. And um, really scrapping it out, Depunier and um, Hayden there. So that puts me up into 10th place. Crowd clutch train, my teammate leads the race as we're breaking hard into turn one. I think I've broken too late. No, I haven't. Yeah, I have. Yeah, yeah. I, f I thought I was going to go on the grass here. So yeah. 
Oh, a little bit of contact between me and Hayden there. Gonna try and stay on the inside. Really, really tricky mach machines, these, because if you uh, upset the balance of the bike, it can really hit you hard. It can really hit you hard, you know. So you've really got to be careful with the balance of the bike when um, coming into these corners, you know, because if you make a mistake and you try to get back on, the thing will just snap massively. So you've got to be really careful with these little with these machines. So yeah, coming into this next corner here, breaking hard. On you can go onto that little um, piece of time that they won't. Um, it won't give you a penalty or something like that. It'll just it, you won't get you won't get anything for this. Yeah. So coming into this next corner, I'm right on the back of Pedroza. I'm just taking it nice and clean. I don't want to get involved in any silly accidents that involve me. And yeah, coming down the inside of two. Look at that, getting past Bran Brado and Pedroza there. Nice. Up into third place, I'm right on the back of Jorge Lorenzo. Breaking early. Oh, there's there, I'm just... There, Bradley Smith there, getting a bit annoyed there by um, Droza there, running into the back of me there. Usually, um, with this game, you know, if someone if someone or an AI goes right into the side of you, or, or um, you go into the side of someone, it's, um, the AI that has been caught, that has been um, involved, um, gives you a little bit of a fist. But it's not all the time, but sometimes... Coming into this next corner, I'm right on the back of my teammate Cal 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 Caracciolo. My bad. Um, as we are now heading into this next corner, oh god, on the curb, on the um, on the gravel there. As um, I'm still in the lead, so I lead as um, Bradley Smith in um, the Tech Three machine. Breaking really hard into this next corner, which is a little blind. Um, which is a little blind uh, left-hander here. Traction control, really. No traction control with my um, machine here. So yeah, I'm having to really be really modulating the throttle here. Not getting too much power. Breaking hard into this next corner. Nice and clean here, nice and tight, so I can get the best exit and drive into this next corner. See so yeah, ya, folks. What's been going on in my life today? Um, throughout um, this week, I mean. Uh, well, not not much. Um, today, um, this morning, I just had my um, French exam. Really, really proud of myself, you know, it wasn't the best I've done, but, you know, it was, but it was, but, you know, it, it was the best in my ability, to be honest, you know, because I'd been really struggling, you know, with, um, with the French and all that, you know, so, yeah, just to get that almost perfect, you know, that, that meant a lot, it meant a lot. For myself, because you know, I I really want to get a good job. I want to get a decent life, you know, get good, you know, uh, get a good job and all that. So yeah, to have that, you know, if I do get a good grade for that, you know, that'd be brilliant, you know, because you know, I think some of the teachers said to me like, this could go really well your CV and all that. So. Yeah, I'm definitely, if I do get an A or something like that, if I do get like a C or something like that, I'll be really happy with that, so yeah. So, coming into this next corner here. Oh yeah, also, um, tomorrow will be my food tech exam. Um, so yeah, it's going to be a three hour exam for me. Um, really, really nervous, but... Um, to be honest, ninety percent of me is um, confidence because you know I've, I've because I've, I've I've made these before. I know how to make these. You know I'm good at cooking, uh, and yeah, I've just 
you know, I just, and I've got a time plan, you know, so yeah, that's, that's, that's useful, so yeah. So yeah, I'm really, really, I'm so confident, you know, coming into, into, uh, into that exam tomorrow, so yeah, I really think, you know, if I don't do well in that, I'm going to be really scratching my head so hard, um, f um, you know, after the exam, you know, in terms of, you know, you know how did I? How did that all go wrong and all that? So yeah, really give me scratch my head if that if I don't get the grades I want. So yeah. And uh, oh, oh um, by the way, um, on the Friday, on Friday, um, what I'm going to be doing is that I'm going to be posting a um, Grid Two video. Now, basically, Grid2 has this little YouTube system where you can just, um, I think you can, um, you, you can record, um, uh, do, you can like, um, you can like capture a little bit of, um, of your gameplay from Grid2 and um, you can actually, um, it's like the same sort of thing to Dirt Showdown, which basically you just um, capture a little bit of footage. Um, you know, just um, record it, um, put like a little bit of a title there, like, I don't know, I don't know, Crash Crazy or something like that, and then, and then, um, yeah, just upload, and um, yeah, it's going to be up on Friday, folks, so don't uh, miss that up, M don't miss that, it'll be so good, so yeah. So yeah, folks, back to the action, folks. We're coming into this next corner here. I've got two laps left. I'm starting to pull a little, a big lead now on the others as we are now hitting into this next corner. Take it nice and clean. So yeah, folks, um, another big... Um, it's a little bit of um, um, a complaint, a complaint to the game. It's just that you know the AI, you know, it hasn't, it hasn't got you know a big, big you know challenge, you know, like F1 2012, you know. Yes, I know. Yes, I know. You know, you know. Yes, I know. I'm good at it, but you know, I really was expecting a big, big challenge um, for this game because you know it's my first time with a bike game for a while. Um, you know, I haven't really, you know, mastered much of this game, and yeah, I was expecting a massive, massive challenge. And to be honest, I wasn't. On this um, difficulty, which is realistic, I'm not really feeling a lot of challenge, and as you see there in this race, I'm pulling a massive amount of lead here. So yeah, I really, I really do think that milestone, I've got to do something about, you know, the AI for probably next year's game, because, you know, the AI just feels really slow. I think the AI just feels really slow, in my opinion. I know I'm, you know, I'm now very, very um, skilled at this, but I was expecting a bit of challenge, a proper, full-on challenge, and for this, I'm not getting it. You know. So yeah, folks, I really hope for 2013, uh, 14 that um, you know this game will be more challenging. You know, to the skilled MotoGP players. You know. And um, yeah, so, yeah and that's the only complaint I've got on my um, in my head at the moment because you know I was doing a, like a little race, um, a career race on Moto Three, um, and um, it was just really the AI was so slow. At the end of the race, I think I was like 40, 30 seconds ahead on realistic. Not good enough from Milestone. They've got to do something about that too. Yeah. So yeah, so coming onto the pit straight. And yeah, folks, that is a win for Bradley Smith in the Yamaha here at the Saxon Rings. So yeah, folks. So here we go, folks. Here are the results. Bradley Smith wins the race um, from Jorge Lorenzo, Valentino Rossi, Cal Crutchlow, Danny Pedroza, Andrea De Pizzioso, Mark Marquez, Stefan Bradl, Alex Espargro, 10th is um, Rani Punier, 11th is Nicky Hayden, 12th is Claudio Corti, 13th is Dilio Patrizzi, 15th is Andrea 
Ivioni, 15th is Hector Barbara, 16th is Cal Abraham, 7th is Lucas Pec Pesek, 18th is Ben Speed, 19th is um, Brian Sterling, um, 20th is Yoni Hernandez, um, 21st is Michael Laverty, 22nd is Colin Edwards, 23rd is Avro Batista, 24th is Hiro Oriami, and yeah, that's it. So, there we go, folks. Up to level 13 in my ranks. Well, he deserves these celebrations. As so, there we go, folks. What a win for um, what a win for Bradley Smith there. See ya folks, thank you very much for watching, see you guys next time, bye bye YouTube.